turning our attention to weather now. We had a cold morning with temperatures and wind chills both below zero, and it's already dropped a couple of degrees just in the last hour. All right, let's see where we go from here. Here's Don Guthrie. Uh, we're probably going to end up in the very same place we were this morning, a couple of degrees below zero, and not much of an improvement uh, temperature-wise for tomorrow's high as well. Clear skies out there right now will again allow that temperature to drop like a rock even faster when the sun goes down, but a few more clouds trying to make their way our direction. May see some of those later on tonight, if not in the morning when the clouds begin to increase in advance of another weather system that uh, brings us a little bit of snow. The operative word here is little bit for the weekend. Nothing even close to us on radar right now. As a matter of fact, we have to fast forward all the way to about 11 o'clock tomorrow night before any snow comes into the picture and then get a little, of a little bit of a break by Sunday morning but the snow returns again by Sunday afternoon, right around 2 o'clock, and then it'll be with us in the afternoon into Sunday night. But again, uh, accumulations sure do look like they'll be on the low side. Neighborhood temps uh, just about in keeping with where the airport is at 13 right now, 14 up around Cortland and down through uh, Mahoning County, 14 out towards Canfield, 15 down around Columbiana Village in Columbiana County, Calcutta at 15. And 18 down at Wellsville, all those temperatures will, of course, tumble on down as the sun goes down. And we did only 15 up at the airport today, right at the edge of my three-degree uh, three guarantee. I went with 18 for today. And you've already heard the low officially up at the airport at two below. And look how low we are. Look how far we are from where we should be. Keep your fingers crossed. Looks like it'll be a struggle, but by the end of next week, Looks like we have a shot at at least getting up to uh, close to where we should be. 13 at the airport now, humidity 43%. Been another blustery day. Winds out of the southwest at 12 with that uh, one below zero wind chill. Also, just a few snowflakes around during the overnight period. So we're looking at about two below by daybreak. And of course, the wind chill, uh, even with light winds, will be anywhere from about uh, 10 to perhaps as much as 20 below. Clear skies early on. That's evident outside now and a few clouds moving in later. Clouds continue to increase during the day tomorrow and just a chance of some snow in the afternoon. We're going to have a shot at 20 for an afternoon high. Then tomorrow night, snow is likely, looks like about an inch on the ground by Sunday morning and not quite as chilly, 13 by daybreak on Sunday. And we'll shoot to almost 25 for a high Sunday afternoon, less than an inch additional accumulation as the snow showers remain scattered around tapering off Sunday night into Monday, 18 Monday, 20 Tuesday, 26 on Wednesday. And by the time we get to the latter part of next week, chance of some snow and 33 for a high. Snow possible again by Friday and another high right around 30. Got to keep a close watch and track another storm system that could affect us by weekend after this coming.